One group of people in sports, and we're hoping we get sports back before we know it, but you may not pay a whole lot of attention to these people until you disagree with them, right? But we couldn't play the game without umpires. That's who we're talking about here. Well, here in the tri-state, umpires already feeling the impact of coronavirus shutdowns. His pants, the correct colored pants at least. The shipment came in two weeks ago. Tyler Paget's umpire equipment. And uh, now we're sitting here with it just sitting in the box now. This was supposed to be his first year umpiring high school baseball games in Northern Kentucky. I was really excited actually. But uh, many of those games have already been called off. Oh! So far, just for the first two weeks of the season, 419. 419 games canceled. Multiply that by 65 bucks a pop and consider multiple umpires for some games. You're looking at thirty to forty thousand dollars that should be in the pockets of local umpires. So yeah, financially it's going to hit these guys pretty hard. And that's just the first two weeks in one small portion of the area. I didn't pull obviously anything out of the bags just because I was waiting for that for that time on Saturday to pull it out and wear it fresh right there. Umpires <laughs> like Paget are actually out several hundred dollars already. Three fifty after buying all their new equipment this year. Equipment still in the box. I've sat here the last four or five nights just like, I don't even know what to do. Cause Being an umpire can be a tough, thankless job like many others out there. Parents or coaches can start to get on you, but that's that's the part of being an umpire. You have to have thick skin. It does take thick skin. Uh, it is very, uh, you have to have patience. You have to have professionalism. It's even tougher though, knowing right now they can't do that job at all. We're gonna get through it. Uh, and once they say play ball, we are going to be out there and we're going to be having a blast just like everybody else. All right, well, Perry, who you just heard from there, not only impacted by the baseball stuff, he also runs a big sports complex in northern Kentucky, which he actually had to shut down due to the virus, as a lot of other business owners did as well. Uh, now, as for individual umpires, if the season does get canceled completely, it could be a loss of up to four or $5,000 for some of them. Tanya, back to you.